Hello, my name is Torn, and welcome to Trophy Hunter's Guide to Bohithia. This quest can be started at level 30 by approaching Bohithia's Shrine, which is located on top of a mountain southeast of Windhelm. When you arrive at the shrine, you'll be told that in order to commune with Bohithia, you will need to offer a live sacrifice. Find someone, gain his trust, lead him to the shrine above. Next, instruct your thrall to touch the Pillar of Sacrifice. Its magic will ensnare him, rendering him helpless. If you do not already have a companion, you will need to get one in order to proceed. I chose to get Lydia since she's easy to get, and at this point in the game, most people should have the requirement in order to get her. Bring your companion back to the shrine and order them to use the Pillar of Sacrifice. This will bond them, and then you just have to kill them in order to summon Bohithia. At this point in the quest, there is a notable bug where the person you sacrifice and gets possessed by Bohithia does not actually talk to you, thus halting the quest line. In order to fix this bug, just go ahead and kill all the followers around the shrine, and then Bohithia will possess one of them and allow you to continue the quest line. My previous champion displeases me. It is time he is replaced, in the traditional fashion. Head off to Knife Point Ridge and get ready to kill everything in sight. Despite being asked to kill everything stealthily, it really has no effect on the quest. Just kill them however you please. Once you kill the champion, simply retrieve the ebony mail from their body and wear it. There you'll be greeted by Bohithia once again and congratulated for your work. As a reward, you will be allowed to keep the ebony mail. This is a heavy armor that deals poison damage to any close enemy and allows you to stealth more easily. Thank you for watching Trophy Hunter's Guide to Bohithia, and if you enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Also, make sure to check out my other Skyrim videos.